Yo, what is up guys? This is Desk Knight here going to talk about and we are doing episode four. That's right. We've made it to episode four. And I always keep my memory in check on what I talk about. And which by the way I always remember. Yeah, so let's head on to episode one. YouTube. Okay, so you've heard of uh, most of you guys heard of Lost Paws before. Uh, really good. Get, he's a really great guy. I've seen him play the games he played on, and I pretty know much that all the games that uh, he played were censored. Those that uh, know by now that he got his channel shut down or took him down before now he brought it back or they brought it back but let's just talk about this YouTube you need to start learning from your mistakes right now I know you just brought back lost pause but I thought it'd be nice to let you guys know that it is not okay to just you know You know, it's, it's not okay to say they took those con contents uh, out of something. Because I know Misty and all the others that have uh, all the anime images that I have seen, they've done a lot of editing. And they got editing software. You know, it's just that it's not a really good idea to just, you know. Like, they could be explaining a lot of other things of what they're doing. Like, the anime man. Well, for him, I'm a, I'm, I'm an otaku myself. Still. I'm into anime a lot. I would rewatch all the uh, anime as much as I want to. I even have Crunchyroll on my phone and on my Xbox, but right now it's... I think they're having a little problem. Which we will talk about uh, soon. To, uh... CEO and creator of the Microsoft. And, uh... And Xbox as well. Like, you know. Anyway, so let's focus on YouTube. Yeah, so... I know my uh, video or podcast will be uploaded, and I know some of you are wanting to ask, ask like, why am I not doing more gameplay videos? It's kind of hard. Because, for one thing, I have to make sure to do a lot of multiplayer games, and it's just that... I have a couple of multiplayer games that are online as well. So, you know, online multiplayer and all that such. And, uh, well, for one thing straight, I just want to make some really cool gameplays for you all and let you all know that I'm doing as best as I can. But YouTube needs to realize that any of the images that all the anime fans have, they should not count for, like, out of context or con context. I don't know how to say that right. Uh, sometimes it's hard. But you know what? I try as best as I can. Also, to those that want to know that will I be doing more gameplays? Well, that depends. If I uh, if I save up and get more, you know, get some donations, you guys helping out and such, it'd be great. But right now, I'm doing only uh, podcasts right now. Maybe later. But anyway, let's focus. Because, for one thing straight, we're talking about YouTube here. I know 
I know what happened to Lost Paws. I know what happened to him. And I like to say that they should have not done that. Like, that's just... That's just wrong. But they did bring it back because of you guys' help. He is a... And Lost Paws, if you're hearing this, know you are an awesome dude ever. 120% cool. Just... Stay as who you are. Do what you're best at. Know what you're best at. And do what you love to do. Because if you want to do reaction to. Or any animes. Or anything you want at all. Just know. Just be. You're the cool dude. YouTube is just. Uh, wanting to. YouTube. I'm probably guessing YouTube is getting a lot of reports from others that say that it's like over the age or, or like this is like 18 years and up uh, that's my phone just two reminders of the events today anyway as I was speaking YouTube needs to focus on what really matters like, uh, there are younger girls doing, uh, you know, twerking and such. Younger girls doing that. They need to do something about that part. But you know what? We're focusing on those that were targeted to take their channels down. That was not cool. Really not cool. Anyway, so... As we're done with that, let's go to number two, Doom. You're going to ask, why am I going to talk about Doom? I thought we are going to go to the Xbox. Well, that's just the one thing. I pre-ordered a Doom game over to GameStop and make sure to buy... Well, it's fully paid and, you know, I just love what they did with the... Doom. It kind of looks like it's... It looks like the first Doom, but remade. And it's just that... It just looks so awesome. Plus the helmet as well. It looks so... Redone. You know? It, it looks awesome. To those that make in Doom... Please know it looks awesome. It really does. Even the animation of it. Even when you're shooting at the monsters and such. That was... Uh, that's awesome. Even with the killing animation. It's, it's really awesome. 120% awesome. Uh, anyway, so, as I was saying about Doom, yeah, it, it's pretty cool. I will be playing it as much as I can. I might try to do Twitch on it, but that only depends on, like, you guys will be willing enough to stay around to watch me play it. Though I will be doing multiplayer games, i probably publish that on... To YouTube as much as I can. Because that only depends. Like I don't have the. I don't have the PC right now to just. I I do have the Elgato. The newest Elgato. The Elgato HD 60 Pro. But I just don't have the necessary PC. Like those I've seen uh, from my, my account. That I posted the PC I'm using. Is not a gaming rig, but but it's not a big PC like I was hoping to have, because I cannot put the Elgato in there. Well, kind of know that um, its space is already being used up. But if I manage to get more out of what I'm hoping for, both on the Patreon uh, account and the uh, 
It's just, you know, it's just, it depends on you guys being a patron. Because, for one thing straight, that I'm having a little trouble with funds. I only get, I'm not going to say it. I am definitely not going to say it. But, I try to make as much as possible from others' help. But you know what? It's just not enough. I try really hard, guys. I really do. But it's just that, you know what? It's hard work. It's called doing hard work as much as possible. If you guys would be able to share this video, video or any other videos I put up, even the podcast episodes, that would be awesome, dude. Dude or dude it's Because you know what? It'd be worth it. Because then I probably make sure to add a bunch of stickers. Even add my own cutie mark on there. So that way when it's uh, up and ready. You guys know what I'm doing. You know whose PC it is. You see my cutie mark. Yep. You see the cutie mark up there, and golly, it is awesome. But soon enough, it'll be redundant because the stage is coming. The final stage. It's going to be recolored. I'm not talking about the Alicorn amulet. I'm talking about the cutie mark behind it. Red lightning bolt and a black shield. With a wolf on the lightning bolt and a dragon wing on the shield. Yeah, we should. I, I need to remember to p keep focus. So there's a. Here it says, I have ADHD and OCD. Kind of like. You know, I have my disabilities. But you know what? I even try hard to. Work around the house as much as I can to make money. I do the best I can. But you know what? That's that's doing hard work. I'm doing all the hard work I can do. Anyway, so... On to... Number three. Phil Spencer. Yes, you know him. You are... I don't know if you still love him or not. That depends. He is the creator and CEO of Microsoft and also Xbox. I don't know if it, uh, he, well, he, he helped make or he makes Xbox, but you know what? The tech engineers are just the ones that help make the design of it. He gives the ideas or, you know, anyone makes the ideas really. It's Microsoft. They make the Xbox uh, 360, the first original Xbox, and the Xbox One. You know? And I still have some 360 games that I still want to play and hope to buy an Xbox 360 because my Elgato HD60 Pro can play the 360 with it. So, if anything, if I use my account on there as well, I could be able to play both the games, both games on both consoles at least. But yeah, Phil, it would be nice if you brought back uh, Dead Space. I know EA wouldn't be able to do a remake out of that or something because, well, you know, I enjoy Dead Space a lot. It's like a, it's kind of like a sci-fi zombie horror film. It's the best sci-fi ever. But uh, yeah, so I don't know if you're going to do that. But please know that I do enjoy all the Xbox 360 games and even Dead Space. 
I know it's probably just best. Or if, if they can't uh, let it be backwards compatible, I will try to get a 360 and be able to play the play it on the Xbox 360 console. I know how much it costs, but you know what? It's a throwback, so you know. <laughs> but it'd be nice if, like, I do get a PO box one day. So you guys can send in fan mail. So I can make a video on fan mail day. Either we can do fan mail Monday or fan mail Friday. <sighs> yeah, so uh, you know. Also, I've been hearing that he wants to have PC games on for the Windows 10 or something. Like, guys, come on. That'd be cool. Play some Xbox games on your computer and play with others. Well, for one thing, you you can uh, install your PC game into the Windows at least. Because, you know what? That means you can join with your friends on Xbox. Those that have an Xbox One, you know, Microsoft linked it to... Well, they linked it to the PC, so that way probably PC owners and, and well, you know, Xbox owners would play together, you know? All the, uh, all Sony has is just PlayStation 4, that's it. I don't know if they're going to make, uh, they're going to bring it to Microsoft or Windows at least. Well, Microsoft did make Windows, so... That only depends if Sony wants to. But, please know that... I know some of you out there are, like, wondering about the, uh... I know there are the console wars going on. Uh, and you know what? I can't be able to choose one or the other. I like both consoles, okay? I like... I have a PS3 still. I like to get an Xbox 360 and be able to play. Well, I already got to the PS3 games. It'd be nice to play some more 360 games. I already do have the Xbox One. But I can't be able to play PS3 on the uh, Elgato. Maybe when. Uh, you know, Elgato Gaming or their channel or the people that made the Elgatos, they can think about uh, making the newest version to let you play. I know you can get the original Xbox, no, not the original Xbox, but the, the original, the first one, the first Elgato HD. So you can play PS3 games on it. That would be cool to let me do that. Plus, I would probably, uh, bring... I'd play my PS2. I'd probably play all the retro games as possible. Because, you know what? These are video games that we love to play. What we love to do, at least. You know, it'd be great to link up everything. Like, I already use HDMI, uh, cables for such. But you know what? Maybe when Elgato does upgrade for a bit, or at least, you know, I kind of know that they're going to do something at least. They might make their own graphics card. But the way that will work is if things are connected. Like, I know you guys want to connect... Uh, Oh, I want to connect something. But that would mean that you got to have uh, two HDMI, uh, you know, two HDMIs. One short and one long. Because, you know, the graphics card of it will probably have fans and all that such. Or if you guys want, you, 
So they could put it uh, laptop-like or make their own gaming PCs that they could design of. You know? They probably have the graphics card or you guys want to make some uh, inputs and such to it. Like you want your... Uh, what the stuff you want. Well, that, that depends. That depends on what you buy. You might get the casing that has the Elgato in there already, but I have to add everything in there. You know, that, that, that depends on the future right now, because one thing straight, you guys want stuff, and I know that will come. I know I want stuff, but that's later. You know what? I'm doing YouTube, and I love to do YouTube. I want to do more YouTube podcasts, videos, everything. Even I want to go to more conventions for you, for you guys. I want to meet every one of you. Even, I like to make autographs if I get my own shop on the on the Etsy.com because you know what that just means that if you guys buy the autographs they're shipping but you know what it'd be worth it because once the thing's straight you guys are gonna be wondering about a lot of stuff plus I have to do all probably autographs of different cosplays or, you know, stuff like that. Even the uh, actors I've met. Yeah, I've met... I've met a lot of... A lot of actors. But you know what? That's depending. And we're supposed to be... Dang it, I forgot. I gotta focus. Oh, shoot. Ah, oh, sorry about my babbling about stuff. But you know what? Bill Spencer is doing the best he can. We probably would wait up on the stuff that we're supposed to have. He is just trying to bring all the PC gamers to... to Windows, at least. But you know what? Give the guy a break. He's doing the best he can. He's just trying to make sure that everyone that plays PC should come check it out. I know they're going to have like gaming PCs that have the graphics card and you know all that but you know what these guys they're doing they're really doing their best anyway so here's this since we're going to be stopping here we got seven minutes uh, left of it I just want to let you guys know that voting will be coming soon but I know there are going to be Donald Trump voters out there. To me, I'm I'm not a Donald Trump I'm not a Donald Trump voter. Look for real. Who wanna? If anybody were to vote for him, it's because there are racists out, racist people out there that want to vote. You know what? Donald Trump is a racist. Uh. Xenophobic. I've hear, heard a lot of things about him. They're all true. Even for me that I... Well, put him as a demon pawn. Because, you know what? He's trying to... I've been hearing that he's a Christian. I mean, you that uh, God's just telling him to just... Jump out of the race because he'll just end America. Well, most likely it'll probably be true. Donald Trump says, Oh, that's not what God is saying. That... That is your imbe... The imbecile thing, whatever. I am not an imbecile. I have a brain. I'm thinking with my brain. I am using the brain I have. Because you know what? I want to vote for Bernie Sanders. Bernie Sanders is a is a great guy. He knows what he's doing. He knows what to say. 
what did Donald Trump do? He got banned from Mexico. Yes, he got banned from Mexico. And he wants to build a wall for Mexico to block them off. Just so they don't have to enter our into America again. That was kind of stupid to say that. Even about the ISIS. I heard he says we're going to catch families and we are going to get rid of their families. He actually said that. Which is probably also stupid as well. Considering I call him a demon pawn because he's doing stupid stuff. If anything, I know which demon pawn he is. Not to hell or to God. Because he's he's not God, Stephen Pawn. He is uh he's a pawn to a another demon that is not in this sort of thing in either religion. I know that I shouldn't say about religion stuff and all that, but you know what? I did talk about the prophecy club before and uh, in the episode 3 because they talk shit about Pokemon and that's not cool uh, last week I ta told my mom about the other one I was talking about before in episode 3 with the Prophecy Club She told me that he's a minister. Like, oh. and to Creflo Dalla, you need to get your shit straight. Pokemon does not make people gay. From the Prophecy Club, it's not satanic. Pokemon is not satanic at all, and Pokemon does not turn people gay. Because those are two stupid reasons. Maybe they're, they're all in it with Donald Trump. They're trying to get rid of anime. You know what? That, that'd be... Wouldn't be stupid, but it'd probably be possible. Because it's true. Anyway, so... I want to say is that... You guys should vote for the right guy, Sanders. Because he knows what he's trying to do. He's trying to get criminals to have the education they need. Trying to get them the jobs they need. Because before, we didn't have... Back then, they didn't have the much money to get the education. And they're, you know, they're in jail for a reason. But now, they get the education. Because uh, if Bernie Sanders becomes president, they make a change. And you know what? They get the job and they get the money they need. Plus, if they have kids, then that means that they get to support them. That's the meaning. Plus, he's been around with uh, Martin Luther King Jr. So, how about that? He's anti-racist. And you know what? He's more s socialized than anything. But you know what? I'm still voting for Bernie Sanders for his reasons. Because, you know what? It's true. Anyway, I hope to see you all in the next broadcast. Not broadcast, but podcast. I hope to see you all in the next podcast. Anything else? Um, I'm still voting for Bernie Sanders. Bernie, know that you're going to be the great president. You will make this uh, America proud. <coughs> oh, sorry. Yeah. Also, I will try to go to the Anime St. Louis. I didn't go to NakaCon because I uh, didn't have a ride. Plus, my dad's still in the hot, in the nursing home. But, yeah, he's still recovering. He will recover. Okay, guys, see you later.